Hey guys, Oakley Foy with Racket War. Hope everybody's doing well. Uh, we're here in Orlando, excited for the weekend. Uh, we're excited to see everybody. Looks like the weather's going to be really, really warm, so make sure and hydrate up and uh, be ready to go. Uh, first of all, I want to welcome you. Uh, we've got over 200 players, uh, all from, I think we're representing 14, 15 different states from all across the country. And um, so we've got a good mix of players from all different levels and all different parts. Um, things to bring with you, and this is going to be a little different here at the USTA National Campus. Uh, you definitely need to bring your own cups, um, uh, your own uh, water bottles if you can. They do have water stations to refill. Uh, we will not, we are not allowed to bring our Gatorade jug with any Gatorade at all. So if you want Gatorade and things like that, you're going to need to bring your own. And we apologize, just they're limiting uh, due to COVID what we can actually have out there ourselves. Uh, so make sure and bring uh, uh, those things. Make sure and bring masks. A mask is required everywhere on the campus unless you're on the court. So and it, we're all going to have to do it. We're all going to be wearing a mask, and there's just no way around it. So make sure and bring your mask, uh, any hand sanitizer you want. Uh, so I would, I would just kind of bring everything. Act like we don't have anything, and then and, and you should be fine. Um, we're doing the clinic later today, uh, 4 o'clock and 5 o'clock, two different sessions. Make sure and check online and see when your scheduled time is if you requested a time. Um, procedures kind of for the weekend. Um, Every before every day you come onto the USA National Campus, you have to sign in um, and fill out a questionnaire and that you're not sick or have had any symptoms or along those lines. That link is on our website on racketwar.com. There's a link that says daily use and you fill out the form and you can do it right on your phone. It takes like one minute. Hit enter. It will email you the form that says you're okay and give you a green check mark and you will have to show that green check mark every day you come to the campus so that's right on our website even for tonight for the clinic you have to do that it's uh so just plan on doing that every morning when you wake up and then you're good for the day just have it ready to show when you walk in because uh, you'll have to show that to even get in onto the courts every single day um, uh, when you first come for your first match, you'll, you already know your court number. It's on the schedule, and you'll also get a text later today with that information just to confirm, but uh, you go directly to your court, whatever court number it is. You don't check in. You don't do anything. You go directly to your court. Uh, before your first match, we'll take your, first, your picture. Your player gift bag will be there waiting on you uh, at your court. Uh, the balls will always be on the courts the whole weekend. Um, and so, And then after your match, you just kind of – Get your stuff, you come off the court, we get a score from somebody. I'll go over that in a second. But so the very first match, everybody goes straight to the court. Speaking of bags, you get your color towel that you're used to, that everybody likes, all the different, sorry about that, all the different colors uh, that you have for each uh, event. So it depends on how many times you've been. If you get a lime towel, it's your first uh, racket or ever. If you get an orange towel, it's your second one, a Royals third, all the way up. You'll see different people with different color towels, and that's based on how many times they've played. There'll also be, if you stayed with us, you get a racket or $20, $20 off merchandise. This card will be in your bag. If you stayed uh, at the courtyard through racket war, you'll have this, and this will get you $20 off the merchandise inside the uh, shop. Um, and also, if you went ahead and added on your shirt, uh, when you registered, uh, you'll get one of these, and you can go inside and get your free Racket or Schedule shirt uh, that's inside. All our merchandise is going to be a little different than if you've been with us before. All our merchandise will be inside the pro shop, and they will be selling it inside. Uh, so it'll be a little different than if you've never been with us before, but all the stuff will be there, and you can go inside and buy it just like you usually do. Um, so that's the first set of matches. You go directly to your court. Uh, when you get done... Usually the winning team brings the scores to us, um, and we'll have a little girl, you'll see her, Ann will be at the desk. She'll be able to uh, take your score, and then as soon as the score gets input, you'll get a text, both winners and losers, to say when your next match is and what court number it's on. And that will just kind of continue all weekend. When you show up for your next match, you go to your court. Now, I do ask everybody be come, come right at <laughs> – uh, Drew, that's Drew. Drew made an appearance for us. Uh, Everybody will uh, go directly to the courts, and everybody needs to be there at least 15 minutes before your scheduled match time. If your match time's at 1, be there at least by 1245, because if your court before you is finished and your opponents are sitting there, then your time will start. 
And so you need to be ready to go. Otherwise, we'll default you out. Even the, the, the schedule time is just a uh, guess. We're estimating. We hope it's by the end, if not early. But be there at least 15 minutes before. So when the matches are over, we just roll right on the next match and go forward. And that will keep us on schedule all day long. Don't show up right on time because you could be late and end up even get defaulted if you're late. So just show up at least 15 minutes early. I won't default you out if you're within 15 minutes. Um so just do that all weekend. Uh, let's see. The, um, the grill, they have a net post grill that will be open from 11 to 2 on Friday. You can buy lunch there. Uh, they'll have it open Saturday as well, but we provide lunch for you on Saturday, so you won't need it. But if you have other things you want, it will be open from 11 to 2 all three days. Uh, there. They also have the play site live streaming, which is really cool. If you have people at home who want to watch you play, all you, you already know your court number. Just text your friends, tell them to get on the USTA National Tennis site campus and give them the court number and then go actually watch your match from home live streaming. It's pretty cool uh, that they have that. So uh, if you just go online, you'll see it uh, for them to be able to watch at home. Um, We'll go through tomorrow's schedule, get done about 3, about 3 o'clock. We'll have the Pro-Am and the Match Point event, which is going to be great. It's probably the best part of the whole weekend, to be honest with you. Um, I will say we're not allowed to bring alcohol in, and we apologize. Um, they don't want anybody social, they want anybody to social distance as much as possible, and alcohol obviously might prevent that. So no alcohol is going to be allowed, uh, but we'll still have fun with it anyway. We're actually going to have the Match Point and the Pro-Am at the Collegiate Center which is a little further, uh, you know, it's about a half a mile walk from where our courts will be. But uh, they, they, they're putting us over there so we can kind of be on our own and have a good time and not worry about it. But uh, basically with the match point, the, I'm going to be playing in the Pro-Am. I'm going to be playing with Ann. We're going to play against, uh, against two other pros, which ought to be great. We'll play for about 20, 30 minutes. Uh, and then after that, we're going to have the match point event, which is basically where we'll have a women's event and a mixed event. And the women's doubles team, if you want to play with your partner, you play with your partner. And we play one point tournament all the way throughout, right there in front of everybody. It's great. People love it, especially when somebody double faults. So what you do is you just come and play and we play one point and everybody puts in five dollars and the winning team gets all the money. And then we'll do mix the same way. We're socially distant at all. You'll have individual places where you stand so you're not next to anybody. Uh, we take care of it pretty good, and it's really it's the highlight of the weekend. People love it almost more than anything we do. And what in Charleston and Wild Dunes in November, we had a six-five women team, women's team win four hundred and sixty dollars. So anybody can win it because it's one point, and it's a lot of fun. Uh, and you definitely need to plan on doing that. That'll be about three three fifteen on um, Friday afternoon after the matches at the Collegiate Tennis Center. Uh, and we'll be, Sherry will be our merchandise, well, she doesn't do merchandise, but our Sherry will have an iPad out there where she can take your money for the uh, match point throughout the day. You can do pay by credit card or cash, and she'll take care of you. We also give away our baskets then as well. We have five gift baskets, which are awesome. They've got a stainless steel racket work, a wine glass, a book, a, a pink towel. The only way you can get the pink towel is from the gift basket. So, it's a, we give those away as well. It's just a matter of being there. You're part of it if you come. Okay, so overall scoring for tomorrow and Saturday and Sunday. Tomorrow, eight game pro set, no add. You're playing 2-8, okay? If you come turning the score and it's 6-2, that's a total of eight, not a playing 2-8. So you're playing 2-8. If you get to 8-7, you play one more game to see if you can get to 9-7. If you get to 8-all, then you play a seven-point coma tiebreaker. After uh, we, we and you play no ads, so you're really playing to four, one, two, three, four each game. But if you want to do regular scoring, that's fine. But at deuce or three all, then you play one more point to see who wins the game. In the mix, it's gender to gender, and women's, it's whoever the receiving team gets to pick the side for that final point. Okay, so that's tomorrow, that's Friday. On Saturday and Sunday, it's regular scoring with a third set 10 point tiebreaker. So you're playing two out of three sets. Regular scoring, third set, 10-point tiebreaker for uh, Saturday and Sunday. Now, look, don't stress out. This is an easy uh, tournament. If this is your first tournament you played in a while, don't stress. It's a lot of fun. We're going to have a blast. Friday puts you where you belong. So if you go lose your first two matches on Friday, then you're well on your way to winning a nice crystal trophy. Uh, so don't stress out. Friday just puts you where you belong, and then after that, you'll wake up Saturday morning, and you'll be in the bracket you're supposed to be in, and you'll be playing against everybody that's exactly like you. 
So we look forward to seeing everybody. It should be a great weekend. The rain looks like it's not going to bother us at all for the first time in like 10 events, it seems like. Uh, it's going to be hot, so make sure to bring sunscreen and plenty of water and Gatorade and all that kind of stuff. And uh, we look forward to seeing everybody soon. Thanks.